Dream King Films. We're here with Bernard and Darius Haven, founders and hosts of the Ladybug Hoop It Up Tournament. Hey guys, terrific event today. Real quick, both of y'all guys, just give me y'all thoughts on today's event, man. Man, I'm just glad everybody came out, had a good time, very competitive, no violence, no nothing. Everybody came as they left as they came. Yes, sir. We had a great time. Darius, give me thoughts on today's <clears throat> event. To build on to what he spoke on, uh, we're here just to provide an experience that it's not really not in Jacksonville's nature. They say we can't do things this way, and we're showing that we can't do things that way. Without violence, it's showing we can behave. Yes, sir. Yeah. Team Nugent, man, y'all brought home the trophy. It's broke, man. Y'all broke it. That means y'all balled out, man, real quick. <laughs> Talk about that real quick, man. Y'all bring it on the championship trophy, man. Team Nugent. Um, I put together a dynasty team. I shouldn't even did it like that, but I had a great time. I ain't even playing no games beside the championship game because, a, because people provoke me to play. Normally, I don't let people provoke me, but they were talking so much trash, I had to get on the court. Yes, sir. Talk about some of the talent you had out here today, man. You had some real ballers, man, uh, out here putting on today, man. Yes, people thought I can't bring the real hoopers out the gym to the park, man. The real hoopers really came out. It was some great talent, like professional, college, high school. It was talent from everywhere, all different sides of town. And it all came together as one putting together a great community event. Yes, sir. Talk about some of those games, man. One of those games, it was late. Uh, I forgot the team names, but it was the red team against the blue team. Yeah. Real intense game, man. Talk about that real quick. It um, came down to the wire. Red and blue game, that's how um, that's how the MVP That's how the MVP came, ab came about. Uh, Travis Mitchell, who was also on the red team, came down and scored like seven straight. All kind of crazy moves. <laughs> Crossover, step back, fade away, jump shot. You name it, he did it. And he won MVP and ain't even win the championship. He deserved it. Talk about uh, y'all MVP game, man. You put on a lot of moves. You came out, opened up the scoring for Team Nugent, man, real quick. Walk us through some of those uh, highlights during that game. I just want game. to show the crowd. It was a nice crowd. I just want to show the crowd. I still got it. I ain't. I still can do what I do. Uh, Jacksonville, John, y'all come support us, man. We are uh, four-time champions. Shit, we, gonna, we got one more in us. Yes, sir. Y'all had a controversial finish, man. Uh, just talk about that real quick, man. Uh, you talking about the team games now? Yeah. Um, it had came down to the wire once again. The championship game, all elite eight games came down to the wire. It was a good competition. Um, I also want to say one thing. I lost my mom June 12th. Um, this tournament it was really dedicated to her. That's why it's called Ladybug. That's her symbol. Um, I don't know. I had a picture I supposed to brought out here to her of her, but I didn't want to be emotional. Like every time I think about it, I get emotional thinking about my mom. So. I try to keep what it is. I try to make an event as after her so she can um, be always remembered. Yeah, so you got your dad in the background. Real quick, call him over here, man. Daddy. Oh. Up um, look, that's that's another thing. My daddy, he ain't had nothing to do with it. And he out here helping pick up trash after the, after it. Hey, Pops, man, real quick. We just talking about what inspired Bernard to put this event on today, man. Such a great event put on by your son, man. Hey, his mom, bottom line, I mean, Mom loved me. I mean, like I say, me and his mom is big, uh, his biggest fan from from whatever from when he started playing sports. Period. And like I say, I mean, he loved his mom so much. He basically was the one almost saved his mom's life. But like I say, that's and if he, I mean, he been down. We've been grieving ever since, ever since June 12th when she passed. And like I say, this tournament was a great success. I mean, peaceful. And we had a great time. Coach, talk about some of the uh, games, some of the highlights that you seen, man. They was out here uh, yeah. going in, Coach. Yeah, they were going in, hey. And like I said, hey, like I say, in, in the park, in, when you're playing basketball, people going to foul, people going to get mad. But at the end of the day, everybody shake hands, help help each other up, had fun, gave each other dap, and, and man, like I said, played ball. It was a good game. Yes, sir. But no, nah, real quick, man, you couldn't have put a successful event on like this by yourself, man. Just real quick, talk about some of the people that came together to help you out today. That's, a, that's another thing I want to get at all my sponsors. Um, Mr. Sunhead, J JJ, um, Blake the Genius, John Marcus, BMC, um, Puerto Rico, JoJo and Friends, um, and all the people, all the little people that actually, everybody who came out, I could have did it without y'all. I really appreciate everything. Like. Y'all just don't know how much this mean to me. And then another thing, I did this in four days. I put this tournament together in four days. Four days, the whole thing. Entertainment, your DJ, he was rocking all, all day long, man, providing the tunes. Real quick, talk about your entertainment. Uh, DJ, man, he had this thing turned up. He played all the music, he switched it up from all different age groups. He had us, had us, had us everybody excited. 
and he commentated the game just as good. The referee came out and did a good thing. Even though they wanted him gone, he still hung around and did his thing. All the food trucks and food nation. Mr. Johnny Hutchison, LA Barbecue. I appreciate y'all, man. These people love y'all food. We're willing to do this again next year. We're trying to make this job nationwide. We're trying to go to different cities with this. So I need y'all help. Y'all help me help y'all. Yes, sir. Hey, we got to talk. We got. I'm sorry. We got, we got to talk about the referee, man. It was on your boy hard out here today, man. Real quick, talk about that, man. The referee, he played basketball, so it's like it's hard. One referee out here in street ball, you know, he got all different kind of attitudes, so it's really hard for him. But he really did a great job to me, even though he missed a lot of, he missed more calls than he made. It's still my boy though, yeah. DJ. Yeah, sir, real quick, before we get out of here, man, look, grab the hardware real quick, do it. Whatever you can grab out of it, man, let me see it real quick. Oh! <laughs> Y'all balled out today, man. Hey. hey, I wanna give a special shout out to my cameraman, man, Dream King, man. He came out here and did his thing. Oh, great film. Man, I know that this highlight tape is gonna be off the chain. Stay tuned, now it's coming. Yes, sir. One more time, man. Just talk about how I feel to have the hard work. Whatever you got in your hand, the hard work is, is all over the place, man. Just one more time, man. Just talk about the uh, feeling of having the hard work in your hand. Man, we drinking Patron celebrating our championship, man. We doing it big out here. Yes, um, sir. This is my big brother, my uncle. He's another BMC. That's one of the, one of the sponsors. Hey, BMC. Bud Moving Company. You don't need no flash when you for that. Move, when you move, we move, just like that. Making sure you check us out. Facebook, Bud Moving Company. Instagram, Bud under slash Moving Company. Hey, Bernard, thanks for talking with me. Good luck to your future. Appreciate it, my boy. Appreciate